Jeff Brines with Fitzgerald's uh, doing a trail check this morning on parallel, a little pre-work parallel. Gonna walk you through the trail. This is a trail that I really like. It's really fun before work. It's really quick to get to. Um, people call it a downhill trail. It is downhill specific. You can't ride up it. But it's also not that challenging. Every jump has a go around. Every feature really has a go around. So this is the top section. This is the only rocky section on the whole entire uh, track, trail, whatever you want to call it. Watch those roots, a little ditch here. I mean, this is kind of the rocky section. Not very rocky. There's a few different lines. That's the one I like. Again, if it's your first time, and if you're more of a beginner or intermediate rider, pay attention there. Um, from this point on, the trail's really smooth. You know, the trail was built kind of for everybody in mind. Even though it does have some jumps and stuff, I may get in some trouble for saying that, but as long as you stay out of the, the landings, stay off the takeoffs and are careful, really anybody can ride this trail. Hey, Tucker, come here, come here. This is my sidekick, Tucker. You ready to go get it? Let's go. So now we go into kind of the flowy, flat, jumpy part. Technical turn. Good boy. It's a little hip here. Set up jump, you don't need to pedal. One little guy, another setup, another little guy. A little headwind today. Usually you don't need to pedal this at all. Uh, trail speed is the speed you need to hit all the jumps. You can see all the landings pretty much over the rock. A little root jump. The light's gonna be tough. These are all real little, not very hard. Then we go into kind of the newer sets we built a few years ago. Big right hand curve, it's always slick. Step down here. And then right hander into a left hander. Again, it's pretty slick. We kind of have alternate lines through here. Nothing very challenging here. Now again, if it's your first time on the trail, pay attention here. These birds have a lot of loose gravel. And obviously people cut them, I do. This is my least favorite section. Now into some pretty cool new jumps. We need some speed. That's that. A couple corners here. And then into a step down berm. Again, you don't need to hit any of these. It's always a go around. There's your go around. We're gonna go down. Left hander. Ah! Manual didn't work. That's how you know you're not. Josh Briceland, right there. Nowhere near that. Tucker! Okay, now we go into some of the jumpy stuff. These are more like old school dirt jumps. These you probably want to check out if it's your first time coming down. And again, if you're more of a beginner intermediate, just skip them. But they're pretty fun, pretty easy. You got a log ride jump followed by three more jumps here. You got Tucker way ahead of me. And a cool hip right here. And that's really all the features on the trail. So if you don't hit the jumps, there's kind of a different route here. Um, there's a little root drop worth looking at. Again, if you're maybe not familiar. So you got a few little jumps like this guy. That guy, couldn't do the manual after. It's getting pretty loose. Go around here, a little drop, step up. Oh, I blew that. 
Jump off the rock. There we go. Down there. Alternate line to the outside here. Sets you up better for the inside. That's parallel. If you want to do another lap, right up there. Whew.